Hi, I'm Bill, and if this is the first time dropping into my channel, welcome. So I'm doing something a little bit different in this video. Um, there's so much rich content out there that's been very helpful to me, and uh, many of you have uh, recommended videos in the comments that have been helpful to me. So I thought I would, and I have, created a recommended list where I will put recommended videos. Uh, these will be videos that I've viewed and they've helped me as a beginner fill in some gaps in my knowledge. So I thought I'd point them out to you on my channel. I'll put a link to the video in the uh, description field so you can click on it and get to the content. This first one that I'm putting up here I viewed this morning and uh, clearly as a beginner I was still grappling with the question of how long should my exposure be and if you go out on the forums like Cloudy Night and other Stargazers Lounge and that, there are a variety of opinions on the right way to set your exposure. And again, we have different types of imaging going on. We have some people with uh, one-shot color DSLRs and we have uh, CCD cameras and we have uh, uh, cooled monochrome and one-shot color cameras. Um, and um, each of these cameras have... Uh, read noise, shot noise, thermal noise. So anyway, um, I found this uh, presentation by Dr. Robin Glover uh, very informative and uh, really is going to help me uh, gain confidence in how I'm setting my exposure time. And again, I'm shooting uh, monochrome with filters. So anyway, uh, this is the first official uh, video I'm putting in my recommended list. I want to thank... Uh, Astrofarzography, and I uh, apologize for not saying it correctly, for hosting the content uh, and uh, making it available to us. Uh, so thank you for that. I have not yet had a chance to uh, check out your other content, but uh, clearly uh, this video from Dr. Robin Glover was a winner for me, and uh, that's why it's going in the recommended list. Um, Dr. Glover is the developer of SharpCap, and maybe many of you are already using SharpCap. Uh, so I found that very interesting. And um, this was a really great, like, 50, 50 minute presentation. Uh, Dr. Uh, Glover is an excellent speaker. Uh, his um, his uh, slides were excellent. Uh, he went into both the high level and into a little bit more mathematical detail on how, what parameters you should be looking at to help you set the right, uh, the right exposure time. So for me, it was very helpful. So I thought, why not recommend it? Because maybe it can be helpful to you as well. Okay, I think that's about it. Uh, I just wanted to point out, so I happen to have these video analytics because I have another YouTube channel. Uh, but uh, clearly, 81,700 people have viewed this video, so uh, there must be a reason that they're viewing it. So maybe I'm not alone in saying that the quality of this content is very high, especially if you're trying to answer your exposure uh, question. It's gotten a lot of likes and, um, and uh, a lot of thumbs up as well. So just thought I'd point that out. Okay, here's the first one for my recommended list. Uh, I'll have it up on the site shortly, or I guess by the time you see it, it's up there. Um, anyway, so, and give me some feedback if you think this might be helpful or you think I'm going down the wrong road here or whatever, because as always, your comments, questions, feedback, input helps me build a better channel uh, so that I can uh, better either entertain or inform or, or whatever uh, uh, through the channel. Okay. Uh, if you like this kind of content, please give it a thumbs up. As always, like, share, and subscribe. i um, getting excited because, uh, let's see, Wednesday I'm heading down to the dark side again and going to be doing three or four nights of imaging, trying to complete my M31 project. So I'm, so far the weather looks good down there. So I'm really excited about that. And actually, after viewing this video, I'm pretty confident with my 240 second exposures, uh, given the filter and the monocro camera I'm using and the, uh, and the filters. All right. Other than that, thanks again for dropping into the channel. Really appreciate those of you who have taken the time to subscribe. Other than that, till next time.